There we go. His hat. Hey guys, what is good, ish me? Holy fuck. This camera is good. You can see my fucking. You can see my cut on my wrist. Alright. Okay, out of context, that sounds like I'm hurting myself. Okay, you can see the cut from the branch from the other day on my wrists. Holy fuck, you can see my mole. Holy fuck. Anyways, guys, it has been a month. Now, let me tell you why it's been a month. I have been into some deep, deep reading. You want to what? Okay, maybe I'm not on this book yet. I'm, uh, I'm on that one. The second one. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've been reading that for the past month. Or for the past month and a half. But something else has happened that brought my attention away from YouTube for a bit. And honestly, there was actually two reasons that YouTube has been getting me out a bit. Um, one, I had just haven't been very motivated to do YouTube. I don't know. I'm motivated to do the YouTubing. It's just, I have a lot of work to do for it. Like, I could just do content like this, like vlogs. Easy. Because I can do that every day. I talk to people every day. Actually, wait. With, with current circumstances, I'm not sure my girlfriend would uh, let me do vlogs every day. Oh, yes. Which brings me to my second thing. I have a girlfriend. And we've been kind of dating for two months. And yeah, I've been mostly talking with her. And that's why I haven't been doing YouTube. Oh, fuck. My battery's getting low, so I have to make this video quick. Quick. quick, quick. Fuck. That brings me to my third thing. A lot of my clips on YouTube, like, you can hear me doing a bit of stuttering. But my stutter is god-awful because... I I'd probably have to do, like, I have to refilm shit, like, a couple times to, like, so, like, I'm not, f like, fucking stuttering through it. Shit, I didn't know we were recording. Uh, which brings me to no, uh, reason number four. I've been smoking some weed. Mm. Note to self, edit that out. Which brings me to my fourth one. I've been smoking a lot of weed, and as seen in my smoke and read video, yes, that's actual weed. And I've been, yeah, like I've already finished the first one. I'm I'm kind of reading into the second one for like, for one for one reason, and I'll read you a I'll read you a quote. <clears throat> well, it's nothing to be ashamed of," said Mrs. Longbottom angrily. "You should be proud, Neville. Proud. They didn't give their health and their sanity, so their only son would be ashamed of them, you know." "I'm not ashamed," said Neville, very faintly, still looking anywhere but at Harry and the others. To those of you who read the book, who read all the books, I mean, like *Movie Flames*, for example then you guys would 100% know which scene I'm talking about. Oh yeah, also, look at, I sleep, I'm sleeping in my RV, and also my, it's been fucking leaking. Oh, and I've also started contracting up the bad habit again, smoking. I've been smoking again because of uh, because of my stress about YouTube. Now, I was thinking, oh my god, I was thinking, and I hope you guys would be okay with this. Like, I'm, oh yeah, speaking of, zombie apocalypse. I'm not done Zombie Apocalypse just because episode 3, well, episode 4 hasn't came out. It's just, when I filmed episode 1, I didn't think people, 
fucking hell. Hang on. When I filmed episode one, I didn't think people would enjoy it as much because my animations are shitty as fuck. But then when act- when you guys actually enjoyed episode one, I was like, well, fuck, I gotta start filming episode two then. So I filmed episode two under a week, like after the first episode was released. It was all filmed. It was all done. But there was something wrong with it. I started doing the exact same mistakes I did with the other zombie apocalypse. And I started introducing a shitload of characters again. Like, the first five characters. Richie, Newt, uh, Steve, Stanley... Fuck, see, Tony, see, it's already, it's already fucking hard enough to think, like, remember the first five main characters' names, but to already add, like, another three at the end of the episode, and then another two at the second episode, and then probably another, another one in the th- third episode, and hell, I actually introduced uh, another character in the fourth episode I'm filming, his name is Luke. I'm not going to get into that. My friend's filming it, uh, voicing him. But Luke. Also, I was introducing two other characters. Um, two girl characters. One was was voiced by my girlfriend. The other was voiced by uh, my girlfriend's sister. Anyways. Should I continue on the smoke and read videos? And... Zombie apocalypse. That isn't that conversation isn't done. I wanted to ask would oh yeah, also I was introducing this guy too. There's so many characters I was introducing. Alright, so would you guys be okay if episode four of Zombie Apocalypse didn't have some characters from like the first three episodes? And episode four is is like is literally. I'm give, I'm about to give away the title of the episode. The episode is called Twenty Eight Weeks Later because. Why is it called Twenty Eight Weeks Later? Well, it's almost it's like been like twenty seven, almost tw- like thirty weeks since I posted the last episode. So I thought it'd be fitting if I put it like because I started filming like, just a couple of days ago to be honest, but the story like. Well, originally, in episode four, everyone, like, Stanley was supposed to be asking why Steve was talking to someone on the radio, and the whole episode was supposed to be focused on that. But then, the voice of Tony, Tyler Krug, he just disappeared for a while. Speaking of which, all the YouTubers I bet you did this ep- this video, their links will be in the description below. But anyways, so the voice of Tyler Krug, he just went absent for like a few months. I texted him. I asked him. I texted him on Xbox too. I even skyped him a bit. Like texted him on Skype. Texted him on Snap. Everything. He just went MIA. And I and then one day he finally responds. I'm like, "Yo, where have you been?" He's like, uh, "It's," I, he doesn't want to get into it. But and honestly, I probably shouldn't be saying that either. I'm probably gonna cut that out of the video, actually. But yeah, there's gonna be like, there are gonna be characters in episode four who aren't in it anymore. And there are gonna be like, they're go- there aren't gonna be in it because it's gonna be obviously a time skip of like twenty eight weeks and. These characters will be either they've gone to go look for stuff, they've gone to go to other groups, or they died. But that's what episode 4 is supposed to be about. Like, where, hang on. Speaking of episode 4, um, where, where is Richie? Oh, there he is. Alright, so... Um, yeah, 
here's the only people I know for a fact is in episode four. Oh yeah, and this guy. Richie, he's in fact in episode. Actually, I'm changing Richie's body right now. Actually. What should I change it to? All right, I want you guys to uh, answer me this one thing about Richie's body. Would you rather have his body be this? Or would you have his body rather be uh, be this? Um, I'll let you guys choose in the, co uh, choose in the comments. Also, so yeah, that's, that's uh, Richie... Newt has the same body, but I gave him a different headpiece because his old one, his old one kept, uh, his glasses kept wearing off. Kind of like Bricks Live Studios' is old Matt. His Matt's face wore off until, like, eventually in his second or third remake, his face just was just, was, was non-existent. Some of my other character, Lego figures also have faces that are, like, non-existent. Um... Oh yeah, also I changed uh, Tony's body, but this is Tony now. Oh yeah, this was old Stadley's head, so I had to get, change his head to this wood. But yeah, this is also, also his new body piece. I'm thinking of changing that too, actually. Um... Here's a perfect candidate. All right, do you guys like this body piece? But oh, wait, we can't, we can't, sh it can't show up without his signature look. Can't find, can't find it right now. Um, cut. There we go. His hat, his hat, the one he promised to dad to look after. Speaking of. The whole Stanley's finding his parents dead thing was supposed to be kind of like his character evolving a bit into the person he's about to become. Oh yeah, also, be speaking of which, considering episode 4 isn't happening. And just keep in mind, I changed the script completely until the season finale. So, this person won't, well, this same thing won't be happening to him. But originally in, episode, well, originally in episode four, Richie and Steve was supposed to get captured by random people because it's a zombie apocalypse. You don't always find the same people. And Richie was supposed to get shot through the head and Stanley was supposed to lose his hand. But I decided that's too early in the series to kill off Richie, considering he's like the main character. So Richie's going to be alive till I don't know maybe till season two or something and and Stanley's keeping his hand forever <laughs> or is he w watch the season finale to find out speaking of you guys don't know this but oh yeah also here's Steve his new look too Honestly, I do apologize for being absent for like a full mo month or two months almost actually. But, you know, it's just all this shit that's been going on. Oh yeah, and plus, I just found out something. Apparently, Mini Lad and Louis Caliber are child diddlers. <laughs> and that's how I'm going to end the video. Thanks guys for watching. Sorry I've been gone for a month. Um... Let me know if you want me to do the Harry Potter. Let me know if you want me to... If you don't mind me changing the story for the rest of the season of Zombie Apocalypse. And let me know if you wanted to see some of the things that I'm working on. Like, I've actually been working on some things, like... Film-wise. Anyways, guys. Peace out. I'll see you guys whenever I make another vlog. Bye.